the fact of the matter is, you'll never get to where you're going if you don't know what your destination is. And basically in my business, I give you guys a free training course on how to start an affiliate marketing business. And at the very end, at the, the last video, I basically have more or less a sales pitch, you know, a webinar, which the first step is setting your goal. Okay, and the reason I have people set their goal and I'm so big on goal setting is exactly for that reason. If you don't know what you want, you're not going to get it. You're not gonna be able to move towards it. And uh, one of the things that I've defined in my life, just to give you guys my goal, is having the ability to be in places like where I'm at now, you know, just being with my family and uh, being able to spend time with my family, being able to go places with them, being able to take trips. And, uh, you know, one thing that shifted is, you know, also creating this startup I'm creating. I'm trying to create a billion dollar company and, uh, you know, but I don't have to worry about the fact that my startup isn't making any money yet because I really pursue these big dreams, these big goals of uh, creating a large company and, you know, and do it without having to worry about the financial problem. Now, I'd like to ask you a question. If time and finances were not an issue, how would you be spending your time? And the exercise I have people go through is a visualization exercise. I encourage you to check out my free training series or, you know, my uh, webinar. You know, there's a link below or maybe somewhere on this page. But basically, imagine if you had all the time, what would you be doing? You know, for me, it's like hiking, skiing, some family time, kite surfing, building a startup, but being able to do so on my own terms, you know, not having to be in the office every day if I don't want to, doing stuff that energizes me and doing problem solving like that. Now, where would you spend your time? Would you just hang out and watch TV or would you, you know, pick up a hobby? Would you be trying to be a DJ? Would you be picking up new skills? Would you just be fishing? Would you be just hanging out at cafes, you know, doing the day-to-day -day thing, going to classes with your kids and drinking coffee and, uh, you know, doing arts and crafts and stuff? What would you be doing? And backwards engineer what business is going to best fit into that from your goal, okay? Does that make sense? Now, a lot of people just think, the way they purchase online education, because as I said, I have over 10,000 students now, and uh, I've talked with a lot of people, and I know how people purchase education. They go for whatever looks like the shiniest object at the moment, generally speaking. You know, and there, there's a lot of other factors. Can I trust the person? Is the pitch good? Is the value good? Is the offer good? Has it worked for other people? But a lot of people don't start with this end goal in mind. So if you start with your end goal in mind, what is your end goal? Do you want to have hundreds of employees looking up to you like you're the king? Do you necessarily need location independence? Are you looking to make seven figures or six figures? Because that's important. You know, some business systems, uh, you know, I have a friend named John Shugarden who teaches how to basically resell textbooks. That's a great system and it works if you're, you know, not very technically savvy and you're looking to create a six-figure business. But it's not necessarily a seven-figure business because it's very hard to scale into seven figures like this textbook reselling business. So it depends on what you're looking for and you've got to really mold what you're doing around that. Hope this is making sense. It's been amazing my life because John's program has actually helped me make an additional $2 million to change my life. I've been struggling to pay my bills and now I have an internet business and within two days I got my first sale. John, hey, it's about uh, 5.40 a.m. Uh, Central Time. I just wanted to send you this video and let you know I followed all the directions, did exactly what you said. I checked in my my account a few hours later um, and I had already gotten 10 clicks and one sale and I could not be happier. Following what you say to do works because it worked for me 